Tetap good. Good morning folks. We got a utility to do today. I'm not done stripping the foundation yet. All that dirt we hauled in the other day between me and Steve, 34 loads of dirt. A huge dip in that pile. Put a lot of dirt where we needed it. It's kind of rough grading this out. Woo. Getting a little closer. So when we come to final grade, it will be quick and easy. Hope you guys had a good Easter weekend. I know I did. This is a traditional egg hunt with a family. Back when you're a kid, you don't think, you know, growing up and doing this stuff with your kids and how much fun you'd have. It's just fun watching them, watching them grow. Big proud. We're gonna start forming up another lot over there and we're going to keep going if you're new here don't forget to hit that subscribe button right down below there if you haven't done that already hit the little notification bell you can find out when I upload videos That's all graded out, roughly. I gotta trek back over it to go get to the other utility. I'm supposed to get done today. And uh, keep moving on. This little hump right there, that's all right. Still got the, the power trench, we got a backfill, wait for inspection still, and who knows how long that's gonna take. So we'll uh, just keep moving on. They're almost done moving their forms, so we're gonna start laying pipe on that. I'm gonna get over there dig the Socus Trench and uh, keep moving along. Oh, looks like Christian uh, must have called ahead of time, was like, what's Matt wearing? Black Carhartt, orange shirt. It's okay, it's okay. here and have never heard of a soakage trench before All the drains from your the gutters from your roof they all go through the pipe on the foundation so that sits on the footing everything will flow out to this corner here there'll be a silt basin there four inch pipe all the way to a big square hole in the ground the ten and a half by eleven and a half foot long pit, you would say, so soakage trench. Well, initially it would be a, it was supposed to be an actual trench, but like two foot wide, four foot deep by 20 foot long. Well, that can't happen because the back patio is right there. You can't have water running under the back patio. So we, we got it modified down to 10 foot wide by 11 and a half foot long hole in the ground. Just a big gaping hole in the ground. And 
Now that I'm through all the basically the hard stuff, I'm going to switch to my flat bucket right there and so I can move dirt a lot faster. got our trench dug here to our uh, Soka's trench right there slough off in there a little bit that'll be fine foundation guys got their uh, <laughs> the look yeah I can't even talk I started thinking about what you were saying but anyway the foundation guys got their uh, all their stuff cleaned up so we're gonna start digging cat 305 e2 all locates came dig it semi easy now that, now that dad's moved out of the way We doing, our job. doing our job. We doing our job. He got 30 cents in the pocket. <laughs> yeah, 30 cents. That was the bus. He came out to uh, just look at things, make a list of what needs to be done. And he gave me the, which is a good. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. Just gotta barely knuckle over it. Oh, you got sensitive ears. Oh, it's cute. Yeah, right where your left foot is. Digging, out, digging with a shovel out here sucks. You want daddy to show you how to shovel? There she is. Watch your mouth. Hmm. Watch your shoes. Oh. What? My talking shoes? You don't like those? <laughs> Fired. Thank you. 
cause a storm, but just a low point. I doubt any water will ever be in this drain. Pulling out that way, it's good. But um, yeah, there's our the city sewer clean out. Tried not to hit that. So it's got to be straight, 100% straight through that sidewalk. Walk right over our pipe. They're gonna make one of their little lines, little stress crack or a, I don't know what it's called. I'm not a concrete guy, but they'll make a line over it. So when it cracks, it cracks in that line that they made, not over just anywhere on the concrete. I just found out that one out the other day. Sewer markers right there. So our tracer wire. So I think the storm is gonna be right over our sewer trench, so make it go this way, maybe 22, shoot another 22, and that'll make it straight. They don't mark the depth of the pipe when they locate it. They just locate it. There's my trace wire. We're almost wrapped up with this utility. They're gonna have this laid in no time. Set you guys up on a time lapse and with some, with some music. That's all, Doug. They're arguing like a married couple. No, no you're cutting it back. No, you're not cutting it back. Anyway, that's all, Doug. I cut them the access in here because they were having to jump out some parkour stuff. I'm gonna go start backfilling some of this. Get that gravel and that back patio squared away. Backfill all the way up to our soakage trench. We'll keep moving on. A little bit of this side backfill that's not pretty yet. I want to make my way through here, get this concrete prep done. Then I'll work my way out this way. See all the mess I got to deal with here. I'm gonna fill this in about to about the grade. So when I go and backfill this, I'll kind of know my grade and I can start there and get my slope. All right guys, we got this all backfilled. I'm gonna work my way around there later. But uh, power inspection just came for that lot and uh, now I get to go back fill that trench. And on that note, new here, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Don't forget to hit that like button, comment, share it with your family and friends. And uh, as always guys, we'll catch you next time.